All right, it took me forever to find the solution and the answers were out there, but I didn't really, um, couldn't really find them for the longest time. So get right to it. Get rid of that, don't need that, and add a mesh cylinder. Okay, render it and you can see the problem. We're gonna have a lot of lines, creases between the two. Don't want that. Okay, so well, it's the first thing. You could have uh, added more um, vertices, 64, but you're still gonna get it at 64. So that wasn't the solution either. And you don't have to. Why use extra vertices if you don't have to? So what we're gonna do is try Shade Smooth, but Shade Smooth won't work. It's kind of make it a mess. So uh, option number two is the modifiers. And we'll add modifier number one will be the subdivision surface. This is what I was told. Okay, I saw that and I thought, well, that's not what I want either, so that's not gonna work. So I hit simple and it's like, all right, but it doesn't really do anything. Um, I can crank it up to three and three, and now it's like, I guess it's a little better. We can render it and see, is it not really? I mean, it's a little, but it's not really. Okay, so the second one I'd heard about was to add the edge split modifier right there. Another modifier, very simple edge split, and it did absolutely nothing. So two things did not work, and I thought, what's going on? Well, it's a very simple thing. The edge split has to come first. So move it up, um, and now you got the edge split modifier on, and you still don't see anything. Go ahead and render it one more time. Say, well, it's like, it's not working, right? So then I forgot, go back, change simple back to Catmull Clark. You can't have it the other way. It's got to be Catmull Clark. Okay, now it's pretty smooth. Render it another time and you can kind of see that. So, okay, but you know, if you look really closely, um, you can still see the lines. They're still there. I thought, well, it probably is good enough to get away with, but I, I do want it perfect. So what can I do? Well, remember at the very beginning, it said Shade Smooth is not going to work. Well, now Shade Smooth will work because the edge model, edge split, um, Shade Smooth. Render it one last time, and it's like perfect. I mean, I can't see any any lines at this point, so it might be there, but I don't see them. So at this point, it's just it's exactly what I wanted. And again, I just couldn't find this answer out there. This is why I did the video. It's just, it was like nobody actually had this in a very simple way that I could find. I mean, it might be out there, but I couldn't find it. And this was a, a pretty simple solution to kind of a problem that had bugged me for like half an hour. Or so that's why I'm putting it out there. I hope it helps. Uh, cheers.